part two of the video hey guys welcome to the homemade septic cable list train fuel or lynch fuel with the 55 gallon barrel for the year of 2022 so let's get into it and let's get very dirty So please guys, before you subscribing or unsubscribing, this channel is an Aromori channel. I usually put a post um, Aromori repair video on this channel, but I decided to do something different because I tried to do it in Spanish and I couldn't get the idea how to speak about this stuff. <music> Finally, the hardest work is done, and now it's time to do the easy one. I'm going to fasten this one with uh, metal roofing nails right here. This is what I'm going to use since they are uh, outdoor screws, so they should last forever. So I'm going to fasten this one in a different way, like I did the first uh, line of up there. So this time I'm going to uh, put one over here and over here and all the way out and in the top bottom over here I'm going to put it on the top like uh, somewhere over here and if this is easier I'm going to do this uh, four pieces at the time and then take it out there where I'm working it because right now it's very hot over there so let's see how it goes to make it perfect and not hard use these clips over here to keep it together that way it stays even as of mine right now it is 100% even this is a lot easier than the other way um, I had to put the clips over here like I said to give it uh, together and tight together and it is very very easy uh, 
the first one I I did as I told you in a first video this is my first uh, project I ever done so uh, I am still learning to the process which right now this is the easiest way and it's really straight even as you can see there is no ups and down it's even and I am so glad I did about this job and I'm gonna do the rest of them like that I'm going to do like four pieces at a time and then I'm going to carry it back over there and then put it together when it's already in the hole so uh, let's continue alright guys finally it is evening the sun then went down over there so this is the job we did today it took me all day to do the uh, channel to put this down and then uh, put the uh, barrel uh, four pieces at the time and then bring it back over here as you can see over here on the middle over here you can only see one uh, a screw over there and there's nothing over here it's because it's inside same thing on this side except on that one over there so and then from here and uh, four more pieces out there over here as you can see there's one screw over there and there's another one over here and then on this side as well and then from here four more out and then I fasten back together over there so I did it four at a time and then bring it back over here because it's a lot easier to do it that way instead of staying inside here and trying to uh, fasten it together but this way it's a lot easier so this is the one I did today and last couple of days ago this is the one I did, I did. This one I did one at a time and then fasten it from all the way from there and out here one at a time. It was hard, it was a lot of work but uh, I learned something through the process. So this is going to take me about a uh, few more days to cover everything up and all that stuff. As you can see that's a lot of mess over here. This is the distribution box over here. That's the inside. Can't do nothing without coffee. Four months later, since September, I finished doing this job over here. But today it is New Year Eve of uh, 2021, and tomorrow it will be 2022. So I know you uh, will not watch this video before this that day, but um, happy 2022. So um, as you can see, there is a uh, three line or three rows. Uh, red over here uh, this is the original way the professional dig and didn't work for them so i end up doing it by myself as you can see that's my over there and the other one right there so really nothing much to talk about this over here it's working fine it's working perfect i don't see any problem at the moment it's been raining a lot so i don't see any problem if it was uh bad when it rains a lot it should be water coming up here or anywhere else i know i mentioned this is all solid pipe from there and here and from here that's where it begins the uh, drums and all the way out over there and over there there's my distribution box right here that's doing good over there and over here it is perfect so it's very even it's a percentage of water is going over there and how much is going on the other side and i should have another one here but i don't so uh, if one day i'm gonna need another one i might have to make another one over here on the side but as you can see water is flowing very good so everything is working perfect right now it's been more than four months almost five months I don't know if I mentioned in the beginning of the video, but over here there is a septic tank up there. I could not do it here because water here all the time. It's like water coming out here, so I moved it all the way out there to stay away from the water. As you can see over here, there is water all the way out there. All the way up there, it looks bad. Over here, I was going to use two of those uh, 250 gallon tote right here. 
but it fell before I finished it because it rains as you can see right now the water it will push it down so at that moment it was already on the ground and the water got into it so it pushed inside it was the top and it squished all over so and then start leaking i tried to fix it it didn't work for me so i decided to use only one of those torch which that's not a good idea let me show you why all right as being only one tank a lot of this uh, waste will escape all the way to the leach field so it is important to have two at least. So that's the reason I left the pipe over there for me to see what's going on inside. But right now it's working so far, but it wouldn't last 10 or 15 years. And then that leach field over there, it will come use this. I have to do another one, but I don't want to do that. So my plan in March or April is to put one of these barrels over here. It's a filter so I'm gonna make it as a second tank but also I'm gonna put the filter in it that way nothing will escape and go all the way out there that way that leach field over there it will last forever even 20 50 years <sighs> that's it for the part two of the video I hope you already watched the part one it should be up here and then another video right here and then subscribe right there Thank you very much for watching this video. I hope it helped you out or get an idea for this uh, project. I appreciate for you to like, sharing, and subscribe to my channel. All of that, I appreciate it so much. And God bless the YouTuber. Until next video, bye-bye.